Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Sam Patton here. So today's video is gonna be a little bit different. We're gonna go through a haul of things that I got from Marshalls and Ross. Um, let's just say I did a little bit of shopping today. So let's go ahead and hop right to it. So the first thing I got, which I'm actually super excited about because our towels are getting old and you know when you just wash towels so much and they kind of get that musty smile smell after a while and it's really hard to get rid of it. Well, yes, this is actually a bath sheet. So it's huge. If y'all don't know, my husband's like 6'3", 6'4". Big dude, we need a lot of towel here. So this is by Nautica and oh my gosh, this is so soft. I'm obsessed. Found these at Ross. They were like 11 bucks each. So I got this and then the other striped. Um, we do a lot of blue in this apartment. It's one thing that we can agree on, a color we really love. So I am so excited to have these and ditch some of our old musty, nasty towels. All right, so next we'll move on to some kitchen stuff that I got. Okay, honestly, I don't even know if you can see that. Look at how cute this is. It's a cactus and it says can't touch this. I literally showed this to James and he looked at me like I was crazy. But if you know anything about me, you know that I have an obsession with coffee and coffee mugs. And I have for quite a while now. But this was so cute. I was like, come on, we gotta add it to the collection. And I also got another large glass container from Pyrex. Um, we use these like crazy. And glassware is actually a lot better to keep your food in than plastic, and it's even safer. Plastic is really not the end of the world, but there's some different chemicals and things in there, even if it is BPA-free. And glass is just a safer, healthier, healthier alternative. So I love these. This is a seven cup or 1.65 liter storage container. It is microwave safe, dishwasher safe. You cannot go wrong, and uh, we can never have too many of these in our apartment. And next, I got some Kona coffee. I, oh my God, it smells so good. I love this stuff. This is whole bean, um, and I will probably use this to make some cold brew. I love cold brew. I drink iced coffee like it's my job, and I need to be better about it, but so good. So sticking with that theme of our kitchen, I got some more pink Himalayan salt. I love this stuff, and it's actually in a grinder, and you can change the coarseness, so if you really want a good coarse salt to top something with, you can do that. If you want a really fine ground salt, also do that. Pretty self-explanatory, it's just salt. And last two kitchen items, I got us some new sponges. I mean, just because we're almost out, and while I was there and I saw them, I figured, why not? And some new kitchen towels. Okay, this is my favorite color in the world, this kind of minty green color. And on that same theme of just having used towels so much, we have some kitchen towels that it's just time to go. Okay, this, honestly, this, I think is one of the things I'm most excited about that I purchased today, and I don't care, make fun of me all you want. I'm gonna show you, but this is like a little fanny pack for keeping stuff in at the gym, and I've been so annoyed. Okay, these are actually new gym pants, so I'll show you those while they're on. They are by the brand uh, Reflex, I think, but it's their like 90 degree collection, I don't know. They were like 12 bucks, they're super stretchy, super comfy, and they cover everything, which I like, because so many workout pants these days are like thin. Like you can see everything through them. So I love these. Anyway, back to this. Um, a lot of workout pants don't have pockets unless you're like going out of your way to get some fancy workout pants or whatever. And I was so sick of, I know this is totally a first world problem, so bear with me, but I was sick of sticking my phone like in my bra so that I could, you know, lift and headphones wouldn't get in the way and stuff like that. There was just no place, good place to put my phone without it getting sweaty or without it falling out or what have you. Hence, my fanny pack. I, like, I don't even care, I'm so excited to use this. You don't even know. 
it's great and listen if you got like a little pouch of fat you just like right there just cover that sucker up no one has to know get you a fanny pack this thing was like seven bucks and I'm genuinely I am really excited to use it and it has a little port for head throat headphones to come through and this apparently is also touch screen usable so I can put my phone in here and if I still wanted to like change the song or change the video or whatever I could still do that through the front of this and this I'm also excited about um, I am a planner and planners are near and dear to my heart look at how pretty this is I'm gonna turn the lights down so it's not so dang bright as you can see a little better but it's like this cream pink color with marbling and it just says 2018 August 2017 through December 2018 planner but I love this and it has some little pockets in the front and then it just tabs out by month and then it puts about three or four days per page so I like this I like that it has lines because I'm I'm super particular when I'm writing on a page about things being kind of like nice and lined up. I hate when there are not lines to write on. So I like that. And this is just, it was just such a pretty planner. It truly caught my eye. And then in the back, it has all the dates of like holidays and stuff and space for notes. And this is by the brand Fringe. I just found this at, um, this was a Marshalls find. Love it. And then I got this polishing face scrub from Piers Apothecary and it is in coconut and it smells heavenly, first things first. But also I love, I'm gonna do my best to try and show you, but I, oh, that just happened. I love that the scrub on here is not too, um, it's not too gritty. It's like a really thin scrub. It's really fine. That's the word I'm looking for, but it's really fine. And when you go ahead and polish it over the skin, I don't feel like I'm left with like cuts and insanity on my skin. For a while, my husband and I were using the Queen Helene scrubs that we got from um, Sally Beauty Supply that I got there. And I love the smell of their mint julep scrub, but it's just so gritty and I felt like it was just kind of rough on my skin and I would notice after I used it actually more breakouts just because it can give little like micro cuts and things in the skin. And so it can leave room for, you know, acne or for dirt to get in there or infection. So. I stick to a more fine scrub and dude this smells hella good and lastly we're gonna get into the clothes so I already showed you <laughs> that was really awkward this pair of pants that I'm wearing right now um these are super comfy and I love that they like actually cover everything so I'm a little bit bigger of a gal and the bottom half and I get so uncomfortable <laughs> With these pants that are like see-through like why are we making it acceptable to wear tights to the gym i don't understand so at ross i found just some cute little tanks that were on clearance just to wear like as a shell underneath either a blazer or a cardigan or even as a cute little summer top you know with some shorts or jeans i got this cute little florally top okay I'm gonna give you like three seconds to think in your head like what size do you think this is extra large like what this looks like it should be maybe a small or a medium I don't know what these brands trying to do but it was cute so I was like <laughs> getting it another cute little florally tank and I like this one has a little cutout in the back I don't know if you can see that but super cute and flowy and 
We have one more shirt. Oh Lord. And I figured this would be great for the gym. This is by a brand called Le Verde. I don't know. I think it was like a yoga brand because I saw it by all the workout stuff. But it's this pretty kind of olive-y color. And then at the back, it's got this cool kind of cross pattern right here. And then there's a little keyhole opening on the back. I feel like that's going to be great for working out. One, because this is super soft and lightweight. Two, because my back sweats like no other when working out. So I feel like maybe having that little hole will kind of help to air it out. We shall see. Either way, it was cute. And then another pair of pants that I got that I really like. These are by Reebok. But I mean, they're just simple black workout pants, but I like these. They were super comfy and both of these, um, both of these workout pants are higher waisted, which I also like. And last, but certainly not least, I think this is actually my favorite purchase of the day. I got this jumpsuit and it is by the brand Emma and Michelle. And it's in this royal blue color, but this is the top. It's like spaghetti straps. And then there's a little tie that goes around the waist. And then at the bottom, these pants are like flowy. So they're not super tight. I feel like these would pair, this would pair so cute with like a pointed pair of heels or flats and just some nice flashy, you know, either earrings or a necklace because this itself is pretty I mean it's pretty plain it's just a solid navy blue but it's super classy and I am obsessed with jumpsuits number one because they look classy while still probably being the comfiest thing in your closet and also um, I feel like for my body type they work really well um, and they're just comfy and I feel great in them I like the way I look in them I'm sorry, I'm, I'm trying to find the tag that says what this is made out of. I'm gonna guess it's some type of polyester. Like it's really soft, but it's, it's not cotton. It's like kind of got that like silky texture to it. But I am obsessed. So clearly uh, Ross and Marshalls are my weaknesses. I'm obsessed, I cannot get enough. Hence the reason that I only go into those stores maybe once a month. So I hope that you have enjoyed my little haul. And do you like seeing this kind of stuff, guys? Um, should I do more things like this and more like makeup hauls? Or do you like more of the tutorials? Just let me know. Um, I'm here and down for whatever it is that you would care to see. Um, again, thank you so much for watching. I know I always say this, but you could be doing anything with your time right now. The fact that you chose to come and hang out with me for a few minutes and watch this video means the absolute world to me. So if you'd like to see more things like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and wherever you are day or night, I hope you enjoy the rest of your evening or morning and we will see you in the next video.